פרשת כי תבוא ראשון, והיה כי תבוא אל הארץ. The Torah is telling us a new mitzvah. When they enter Eretz Yisrael, Hashem wants the Jewish people to keep unique mitzvah. Asher Adonai Eloheich Nutzen Lachan Achalav Yerishta V'yashav Taba. Hashem will give you a land, you will inherit it, you will live there. Meaning you'll plant fruit, you'll plant farming, and you'll have produce. So before you do anything, This is the famous mitzvah called Bikurim. There's a whole Masechet of Mishnayot about this, called Bikurim, where the farmer basically goes out to the field. As soon as he sees the first fruit growing, he takes a red string, he ties it around that fruit. Later, when the fruit ripens, he has a mitzvah, as we're going to read, to bring that fruit, the first fruit or fruits, to the Beit HaMikdash. As it says, You should take from the beginning of each fruit, which you came out of the land that Hashem gave you, you put it in a basket, you go to the place that Hashem chosen to be the Beit HaMikdash. What do you do? You go to the Kohen, it's a whole process, the Kohen takes it from you, he brings it to the Mizbeach, and there's a whole answering and saying, there's a whole process, you have to say a whole thing. Basically, the Mitzvah Rashi explains is, Maskir Chazdeham Akom, Hakaratatov. Hashem gave you a land, gave it to you for free, gave you fruits, you take what you have, you bring it to the Beit HaMikdash, the first produce, and you thank Hashem before anything. If you do all this, what does it say in the end? Pasuk Yudal, Vasamachta, Vechol Hatov. If you have a karatatov and you appreciate what Hashem gave you, Hashem guarantees you you'll be happy in everything you do. It's a lesson for us all. Always thank Hashem constantly. You thank Hashem, the Samachta Bakulatov.